Today on MTG Unpacked, it's Mystery Booster time again. So we're cracking eight more packs of these. So these are odds and ends from the previous two boxes. And we're cracking these for patrons. The patrons today are Jonathan Vogelsang and Timson. Okay, so Timson gets three packs. And then Jonathan was after five. So we'll take care of that right away. Let's get into it. We'll start off with Timson. Thank you for being a patron. And these things seem to be selling like hotcakes. I don't know if anyone was able to get a box or not. The prices are going up day by day, it seems like. So hopefully you were able to at least draft this or crack some packs. Okay, we start off with Glint Sleeve Artisan. And by the way, the patrons get the rares, mythics, foils, and anything over a buck. We have Pitfall Trap, Deep Freeze, Riverwill Arius. Aerialists, Bone Splinters, Desperate Castaways, Inferno Jet, Cosmotronic Wave, Reclaim, Feed the Clan, Shambling Remains, Creature Zombie Horror. I don't even know what I'm looking at there, that's pretty weird. Sajiri Refuge, Harkon Stronghold Scourge, Zombie Knight, that's pretty cool. And the rare is Cage Sun, Artifact for 6, as Ants Battlefield, choose a colour. Creatures you control of the chosen colour get plus one plus one whenever a land's ability equals you to add one or more mana of the chosen colour. Add one additional mana of that colour. And a foil pan glacial worm. I think that's a rare as well. Creature worm, nine five for seven. With trample, while you're searching a library, you may play pan glacial worm from your library. There he is. Okay, so that reminds me, Ikoria, Lair of Behemoths. Who is looking forward to it? I bet there'll be more than a couple of those worm guys in the set. So that comes out next month. Looking forward to it. Okay, next we have Aura of Silence. And by the way, if I have missed any prices here that I've found during editing, I'll certainly put those cards aside for the patrons. But Levenet Ancestor, Clear the Mind, Thornwind, Fa Thornwind Fairies, Annihilate! Skeletal Scrying, that's pretty cool artwork. Seismic Shift, Cartouche of Zeal, who remembers the cartouches from Armanket and Hour of Dev, Jungle Delver, Longshot Squad, Shipwreck Singer, Jungle Hollow, and what is this, uh, Mistform Shrieker. And rare is Deep Glow Skate, Creature Fish. <laughs> 3-3 three, three for 5, when it ends battlefield, double the number of each kind of counter on any number of target permanents. And a foil, Proclamation of Rebirth. Looks like a foil rare, sorcery for 3. Return up to 3 target creature cards with convert mana cost 1 or less from your graveyard to play. As forecast, 5 and white. Reveal Proclamation of Rebirth from your hand. You get to return target creature card with convert mana cost 1 or less from your graveyard to play. So one of the things I love about these packs is that I have never seen most of the cards here. Or maybe maybe I've seen uh, 30 to 50 percent if I'm lucky. So there's an awful lot that's great to discover. Okay, next up we have Oust, Court Homunculus, Call to Heal, Doorkeeper. He looks like that guy from uh, Monsters Inc. Butcher's Glee! Watch out for this little thing. Gurmag Angler, Maximize Velocity, Fierce Invocation, Crawl Foragers, Sitinal Wood Readers, Terminate, Frontier Bivouac, Doomgape, what? Loving this artwork, that's crazy. This thing's old teeth. Creature Elemental 10, 10, 4, 7, craziness. He has Trample at the beginning of your upkeep, Suck a creature, you gain life equal to that creature's toughness. And another rare here, Taurian Mauler, Creature Shapeshifter 223 with Changeling. This card is every creature type. Whenever an opponent casts a spell, you may put a plus one, plus one, counter on Taurian Mauler. And a Foil Sheltering Ancient. Nice tree folk there. All right. So there we are, Timson. Enjoy the pools. Uh, my favorite would have to be this thing here. That's just craziness. Leave a note in the comments if you have a favorite card pulled in this video, which hopefully will be the Mana Crypt, but if not, uh, something else that takes your fancy. All right, we'll pile these up. Jonathan Vogel saying, you're up next, sir. Thank you for being a patron. 
So we have five packs of goodness here, at least I hope it's goodness. We have Thraben Inspector, Pressure Point, Failed Inspection, Ether Snipe, Aid the Fallen, Knight's Whisper, Burst Lightning, Fury Charm, Hooded Brawler, Priest of Titania, Skyward Eye Prophets, Dismal Backwater, and a rare Dungrove Elder, Creature Tree Folk Star Star for three with Hexproof. Dungrove Elder's power and toughness reach equal to the number of forests you control. And another rare, that's pretty cool, Phyrexian Plague Lord, Creature Carrier 4-4 four, four, for five. You tap, sack it, target creature gets minus four, minus four until end of turn. Sack a creature, target creature gets minus one, minus one until end of turn. Nice pull there. And a foil, Stalking Stones. Okay, so those stones, it's like Stonehenge walking around. A little unusual. Okay, on to the next. We have a Sparring Mummy, Reviving Dose, Sphinx's Tutelage, Factor Fiction, Breeding Pit, Grotesque Mutation, Outnumber, Uncage Fury, Secure Tribe Elder, so I know that one used to be over a buck, I think it still is, I'll chuck that in as well, Daggerback Basilisk, Join Shields, Thran Dynamo, there's another nice pull, set to the side, and rare is Wargate, Sorcery for X, Green, white, and blue. Search library for a permanent card with convert mana cost X or less. Put it into play, then shuffle your library. And the second rare, Jin of Wishes. Creature Jin 4-4 four, four, for 5 with flying. And spider filled with 3 wish counts on it. You pay 2 and 2 white. Remove a wish counter from it. You get to reveal the top card of your library. You may play that card without paying its mana cost if you don't exile it. And a foil, Viscera Seer, Vampire Wizard. Alright then. So, hoping for some juicy goodness here, nothing too crazy so far, unless I'm mistaken, in which case you would have seen the price pop up already. We have Gift of Estates, Pressure Point, Chillbringer, Leapfrog, Vampire Nighthawk, Moment of Craving, Gitu Lava Runner, Seismic Stomp, Become Immense, Lay of the Land, Contraband Kingpin, Ghost Quarter, I'm um, not sure about that one. I'll have to check. Carvex Torch. Ooh, that's pretty cool from Mirage. And the rare is Desolation Twin. Creature Eldrazi 10 10 for 10. What? When you cast Desolation Twin, put a 10 10 colorless Eldrazi creature token onto the battlefield. Nice. And a foil mythic. Sarkhan the Mad, 7 loyalty for 5 in the Rakdos Colours. His 0 ability here, reveal the top card of your library, put it into your hand. Sarkhan the Mad, do damage to himself equal to that card's convert mana cost minus 2. Target creature's controller, sacks it then, that player puts a 5 5 red dragon creature token with flying onto the battlefield. Minus 4 each dragon creature you control deals damage equal to its power to target player. Alright, any Sarkhan fans in the audience? And looks like we have another avalanche over here. Okay, last two packs. Jonathan, are you on the edge of your seat, sir? Because if you are not seated, you probably should be. Maybe there's going to be something crazy here, or at least uh, you're comfortable. If there isn't, we have Celestial Crusader, Great Horn Krushok, Silver Gill Adept, Arcane Denial, Blister Grub, Grey Merchant of Asphodel, didn't know they printed him here as well. Bloodstone Goblin, Creature Goblin Warrior. Arn Crop Crasher, that was good in the aggro decks at the time. Rock Smallers, Bitterbow Sharpshooters, Wayfaring Temple, Bone Saw, and the rare is Rith the Awakener. Nice, I know you like the dragons, so here's another one. The Dragon Creature Dragon 6646 with flying. Whenever Rith the Awakener deals combat damage to a player, you may pay two and a green if you do choose a color. And put a 1 1 green sapling creature token onto battlefield for each permanent of that color. And another rare here Savage Knuckle Blade. Creature Ogre Warrior 4 4 for 3. 2 and a green. He gets plus 2 plus 2 until end of turn. Activate its ability only once each turn. 2 and a blue. Return it to its owner's hand. And a red gains haste until end of turn. 
And a foil storm crow from ninth edition. Exactly what you were after. A total meme card. Okay. One more pack left. And I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button for more Magic Going Unboxings. And be sure to set the notification bell to be notified as soon as new videos release. Okay, what do we have in this final pack for Jonathan? Desperate Sentry, Lieutenants of the Guard, Predict, Tidal Wave, June Beetle, Rabid Bloodsucker, Ezra Bladeseeker, Rummaging Goblin Creature, Goblin Rogue, yes! Love the Goblins, Byway Courier, Bestial Menace, Ukran Assassin, Sunset Pyramid, and rare is Kragenwick Cremator! Creature Giant Shaman 5-4 four, for 4. When Crag and Wick Cremator comes into play, discard a card at random. If you discard a creature card this way, Crag and Wick Cremator deals damage equal to that card's power to target player. And the second rare, ooh, that's a nice one, Aether Flux Reservoir. Artifact for 4. Whenever you cast a spell, you gain 1 life for each spell you've cast this turn. Pay 50 life, Aether Flux Reservoir deals 50 damage to target creature or player. This card, when I was first playing Magic, absolutely blew my mind. I'm like, how can you pay 50 life? And then my opponent promptly got more than 50 life and knocked me out. So that was a eye opener and a foil mythic Lich's Mirror artifact for five. Let's say a little creepy. If you would lose the game and said shuffle your hand, your grave out an old permanent you own into your library, then draw seven cards and your life total becomes 20. All right, good deal. So nice, we've got a couple of Mythics this time round. We'll tuck these in here for Jonathan. Thank you for being a patron once again, sir. Thanks for watching and have a great day.